Right, this test shows the point at which the Spectrum 6100 receiver suffers a brownout due to dropping voltage. I'm using an adjustable power supply unit on the right, which displays the voltage supplied on its LCD. The meter over on the left also confirms the voltage being seen at the receiver as it's connected directly to an auxiliary port on the receiver. The small LED volt spy also gives a visual indication of the voltage level. One, uh, one servo is connected which I can activate to uh, increase the load on the receiver and I'm going to start the voltage off at 6 volts which is the maximum for the servo and reduce in steps of 0.1 of a volt to the point where brownout occurs. Transmitter is on. I'm going to start the power supply. And the voltage should climb to 6 as shown by the meter here and also here the receiver you can see has a steady red light and the volt spy is in the full perfect green LED position servo activated as normal by the elevator control I'm now going to reduce the voltage I'm now down to 5 volts as shown on the display of the power supply and also the monitoring meter. Volt spy has dropped to the lower of the two good green LEDs. We still have steady constant LED. Receiver is perfectly happy at 5 volts as expected. And servo is fine. You can see the volt spy will flicker into the red as the voltage is being depressed down to 4.9 or so according to the meter on the left 4.93 we just hit so still fine we'll drop the voltage further we're now at 4.5 volts as confirmed by both meters volt spy is now in the critical red receiver is still happy and servo is also still happy. Voltage depresses to 4.43, 4.41, let's call it, there we go, 4.4 is the lowest and still no brownout on the receiver. We're going to drop the voltage again now even lower to 4 volts. 4 volts on both meters 4.01 and 4.00 obviously still the volt spy is on the critical red again still no brownout receiver is obviously happy at 4 volts and servo depresses the voltage to about 3.95 3.96 again no brownout We'll come down even lower. Okay, we're now at 3.5 volts, which is Spectrum's absolute minimum safe voltage. Well, not safe, but absolute minimum operating voltage. And uh, again, you can see, as yet, the receiver is still happy, no brownout. Moving the servo may well dip the voltage slightly and cause a brownout. Let's see what happens. Well, according to the meter, we're down to momentarily 3.46 and the receiver is still steady. So let's drop this slightly again on the meter. 3.4 LED is still steady 
3.3, still no brownout. 3.2, still steady. Servo activation drops the voltage to 3.17, still functioning. Down lower. 3 volts, steady LED. And now we have a brownout. So we got down actually to 3 volts and servo activation before the receiver brownout kicked in. End of test.